Okay, we're back. Um, the connecting points for the axles um, here is the original uh, frame for the original Mini Monster ATEC vehicle. Uh, these are the connecting points. These, these are the. Um, there's three connecting points. This one, and then these two down here, which allows it to gives it pretty good mo mobility. Kind of like a kind of like a rock crawler. These were the connect. These were actually the the connecting point uh, rods, and these were the originals. And as you can see, they've been lengthened out. I used the same technique as I did with the uh, the drive shaft, where I dremeled it in half, and then I used the antennas, the tubing for the antennas, and then I used I believe this one, uh, and I measured out what I needed, and then glued both sides. On this, I'm not sure if you can tell, but right here, this is a little screw. I was able to dremel through the the cylinder the antenna cylinder and then through the plastic and able to glue it as well as screw in um, so I can refortify the, the connecting point the connecting rod so those two are there and down here this one this is another connecting point and you see the triangle here there's a triangle um, this needed to be extended so I used more tubing to uh, bridge the gap between between the two I drilled I drilled a hole through where I wanted my my triangle connecting point going through and then I made sure that there was a spacer in between these two that way it wouldn't go left and right without it actually this one has to be as stable as possible so then there's my three connecting points one two and then three here and that was the one two and three the third one that went right here um, on this triangle one there's no way of really modifying it other than to compromise the whole thing but you don't want to do that because it maintains a little bit more integrity of the original axle those are the axle connecting points uh, same thing in the back you can see a little bit more clearer um, this is the connecting point up here and for the triangle and th these rods are a lot longer than this one back here so that's the axles. I use both of the same axles in the back. This one looks a little bit different only because I took off the, the top portion of it because it interfered with the the front. Um, but they're, they're the same axles. Uh, four wheel drive, uh, it's pretty fast. Uh, another thing with the tires, I'll show you a little tutorial on the tires, uh, how I, I did connect them to the model itself. You might be wondering why I'm doing this in short videos. Uh, I know it's a little bit annoying, but um, loading it up on, on YouTube, it's such a pain um, for a 20, 30 minute video. So I'm doing these little ones and this way you can, uh, you might be able to jump ahead to the portions that you have questions on. Uh, once again, if you guys have any questions, uh, let me know. Uh, keep the imagination, imagination running and don't forget to play with the toys. Uh, that's why we have them, not just to collect them. But okay, you guys take care, have fun. Let me know if you have any questions.